Let's show you how to get PHP Code Sniffer up and running using Composer. In my opinion, using Composer to manage PHP CS is a wise choice. Uh, after all, Composer is just a depend dependency manager, um, kind of like NPM or Yarn. It just manages packages. You tell it, I want this, and it goes and gets it for you and even adds it to your command line's path. Couldn't be easier, so that's what we're gonna use. Um, if you don't have Composer installed, hop over to getcomposer.org, click on download. If you're on a Mac, you can even type brew install composer. It's on homebrew. Uh, and once you have it up and running, then you can proceed to the next step, which is actually installing PHP Code Sniffer. What's great about Composer, um, other than obviously it's a package manager and it, it uh, can install things easily, is just that. It can install things pretty easily, even globally. So what we're going to do is copy this command and paste it in and run it. But what it's saying is, hey, Composer, I want you to globally install this package. The star simply means install the latest version. Um, you can get specific and install a, a version number of your choosing. Um, for this purpose, we're just going to copy and paste this command, drop it right into my command line and hit enter, and let Composer go out, grab PHP code sniffer, install it, and go ahead and add it to my path. So now if I type which PHP CS, you can see I have uh, in my home directory a path to PHP CS. If you're on Windows, you can type where.exe PHP CS and it will uh, show you where it installs. On a Mac, it's not gonna run. <laughs> so that's it. Now we have PHP CS available to us via the command line. Up next, I'm gonna show you how to install rule sets.